Hello, everybody out there. This is Mr. All Sports All Day, bringing you your daily dose of sports news. I want to thank you all for listening, popping me in. It's been a long time coming, going hard to the end. Call the Raider fans, with the first pick in the 2007 NFL Draft, the Oakland Raiders select quarterback. Marcus Russell, LSU. So how do you exactly come back from being one of the biggest draft busts in NFL history? Well, that's exactly what the Bleacher Report is trying to find out when it comes to Jamarcus Russell with their comeback 2013, Jamarcus Russell's road, road back to the NFL. They recently just released the trailer coming on February 10th, that is exactly yesterday. Uh, this project, I'm not sure, uh, if it, I believe it's being documented here by Aaron Negler, the founder of CheeseheadTV.com, website dedicated to the Packers. I have no idea why you'd make a website to that awful team. I'm kidding, of course. Here, I'm going to try to be as unbiased as I can, uh, but I'm going to read the article pretty much. Um, you know, and then just give my opinions on it. That That's how I want to uh, do this. If there's videos or pictures, that's definitely what you guys are going to be seeing right now. Uh, maybe my beautiful face one of these days, but uh, uh, I don't know right now. <laughs> Alright, so <clears throat> I'm going to read the article. That's what we're about to find out as we follow Jamarcus Russell, who went from the MVP of the Sugar Bowl and first overall pick of the Oakland Raiders in 2007 to out of the NFL in 2010. This, of course, after he signed a six-year contract with the Raiders up to $68 million, with $31.5 million guaranteed. We'll be there to chronicle every step in the process from now through April when Russell plans on holding a pro-style workout for the NFL teams. His plans include working at the Test Football Academy, being tutored by former NFL quarterback Jeff Garcia on technique and getting help from a bevy of other NFL players, trainers, and coaches. Now, I believe that uh, Marshall Falk, former running back for the Colts and the uh, Rams in the 90s and early 2000s, said he was also going to help out Jamarcus if Jamarcus wanted to focus just, just on football instead of being the glamour boy that he was. Uh, just to throw something on there. Alright, so while many observers scoff at the notion of a, of a comeback for a quarterback who reportedly still tips the scales at over 300 pounds, seriously guys, you'll be watching the video and looking at the pictures right now. Uh, I'll be playing the video probably afterwards. Words or, or something, I'll figure that out. Um, yeah, but he's a big boy. <laughs> Former LSU star is determined to make an NFL uh, to make NFL general managers and talent evaluators give him one last look. Video that we're gonna watch next is our first quick look, a trailer, if you will, showing Russell's first steps towards his goals. Will he beat the odds? Let us know what you think in the comments below. So that's their direct quote. Please let me know what you think about the comments below. Um, so right now I'm going to play you the video, I believe. This is going to be a one story a day type show. I may have a weekly show documenting quite bigger stories, if that's what you guys want. But please enjoy this video. Uh, tell me below what you think about a Jamarcus Russell comeback. And, uh, and I will see you guys after the video is finished for my analysis and my opinions. See you guys after the video. Hi, I'm Jamarcus Russell. I'm here at Texas West Academy. And I'm on the verge and the progress of getting myself back in the NFL. Right. Reintroduce you to that thing, man. We're gonna get comfortable with it again. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Okay. Today is really an introductory day. It's about getting a feel for Jamarcus, seeing where he's at currently with his physical conditioning. So I want to be able to work with Jamarcus on the field right now. I want to see him drop. I want to see him do a three-step drop, a five-step drop. I want to see the mechanics of the quarterback. Uh, position, how the ball is coming out of his hand, where he is with his feet. I want to get just a, a basic analysis, uh, a starting point, a foundation of what we're working with so that now we can somewhat break him down and then build him back up. Here we go. Good with the feet, man. Good leg bend, good leg bend, drive out of there. Good feet, good feet. Hits and throw. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. Finish every throw. Finish every throw. Great mechanics. Drive back. There you go. Good eyes. Good eyes. There you go. Finish it down. Finish it down. Finish down with it. Follow through it. Here we go. Give me a good one. Give me a good one. Boom. 
There you go. Good finish. Good finish. That's good. That's good for right now. Just get a good feel for where you're at, your feet. All right, guys. So uh, tell me down in those comments right now uh, if you're still watching. What did you think about that video? Oh, that's interesting. That's an interesting opinion. <laughs> nah, but uh, in my opinion, the the thought of a comeback from from a player like this it it brings a couple emotions. My first was like I said, you know, pff, why? You know, he's such a bad he was such a bad player. But you know, looking at the highlight videos and you know, he was such a good player in college. Um, yeah, I think he still got the talent. He always had the talent, but it was the personality and the cockiness that got him. And so, one, I don't know if that's still with him, but I think the fact that he's going through these little drills and how he seemed excited to just be doing any sort of football, you know, he's like, hey, can I sleep with him, man? You know, that kind of, you know, sleep with the football. I think he's, he, he realizes, and I can hope that he's matured, you know, instead of being Jamarcus Cocaine Russell or whatever, um, he can, you know, he can mature and be a, a player because I think he has a legitimate future if he tries uh, obviously we just saw him throw a couple passes but I want to see more from Jamarcus Russell because uh yeah he definitely had the talent uh, if he can be mature I don't see why not he can't be up there uh, being a good quarterback because he's got the skill and people are looking for skill quarterbacks these days instead of you know game managers uh, you know you're looking at people like Colin Kaepernick getting taken over Alex Smith uh, just things like that, you know, you see those big play guys, the big arms too especially, and the big legs, you know, a Cam Newton type player, because uh, Cam, I think, is very similar to Jamarcus in a bunch of ways, except Jamarcus is like 300 pounds, you know, uh, he's a tank, he can literally, he can play like defensive end, he can play defensive tackle if he wanted, the guy was huge, he needs to lose weight, uh, but he can still stay pretty bulked up, but yeah, that's my opinion, guys, uh, leave any sort of opinions you guys have below i'd love to hear them i'd love it i'd give you a shout out whatever i give you a big hug big kisses blah but thank you guys as always for tuning in to mr all sports all day getting your daily dose of sports news and gaming and until next time guys uh I, I need to come up with an official outro but until next time i suppose just uh just have a have a great day and uh see you next time